So this project is based on Quidditch from... Ooh, sorry. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a spontaneous finale for the Harry Potter and the Pan of Fire project pan that I'm doing with the Fantastic Ladies. This video doesn't go live until the f day of the finale, but this is a week early. <laughs> Just so you know. So if you're new to this project, this was created by the Fantastic Ladies on Facebook and it was created by the lovely Amanda D here on YouTube and Makeup Junkie 80 on Instagram. She is one of my best YouTube friends at the moment, so yeah, you should check her out. She will be in the description box together with all the other ladies that are in this project. So this project is based on Quidditch from Harry Potter. So three of the products are going to be linked to Quidditch and two items are going to be linked to your favorite house or just the house of your choice from Harry Potter. We have the Golden Snitch, the Bludger and the Quaffle. For Golden Snitch, I had uh, the Body Shop Facial Oil, the Oils of Life Facial Oil, I believe it's called. I finished that up um, uh, a few updates ago, I believe. But I finished that product and I liked it a lot. For, let me, let me, sorry. So for the bludger, I chose this black item and it is the Suiva Matte Eyeshadow Fix Long Wear Eye Primer. This one right here and I deposited it into this jar because it was really hard to get out. And I have been working on this part for like two months, maybe more. It's no way near done. You can see I don't have a lot left, but it lasts forever. If you have tried to pan an eyeshadow base or eye primer, you know what I mean. But I don't mind. I love this eye primer and it haven't dried. Why are trucks always drying when I'm filming. As I was saying, it hasn't dried out or anything or become more dry when I have deposited it into this. So that's good. But this is an amazing eyeshadow primer if you haven't tried it. It, gets, it covers your veins or your eyelids, but it's not full coverage, you know? It's, it's, it's a nice product, it really is. For the Crawl, which is this red, Let me start over <laughs> for the crop. Where's the cap? Where is the cap? I have concealer all over my floor. Seriously, where's the cap? <laughs> I'm not even joking. Where is it? I can't find it. This is now officially dirty. I will find it afterwards. Okay, I'm so sorry. But for the Corfu, uh, the color was red and I chose my Maybelline Instant Anti-Age The Eraser Eye Concealer. This one right here. And here you can see my progress. I started here, first, second, and now finale. You can see my progress and I, I'm not going to finish this by the next week anyway so that is why yeah but i will keep trying to use this up even though i'm beginning to use two concealers because this is going to be too dark for me in the winter time so i'm chugging away i'm using it and i'm loving it it is going but it was just not done in this project but you will see it in my empties in a month or so for my favorite house, I chose Gryffindor because I am a Gryffindor myself. And for that, there was two colors, obviously, scarlet and gold. I hate trucks. So for my scarlet color, I chose this lipstick. This is the Max Factor Color Elixir lipstick in Scarlet Ghost. So Ghost was a perfect thing for Harry Potter because there is Ghost on Hogwarts and Scarlet was the color for Gryffindor, so why not, right? So this is the lipstick now. I'm so excited because this is so small now, but I'm not going to finish this in a week. 
I'm not. But, 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 let me show my progress and let's chat about that. That is my progress. So this is the intro, this is the first and second update and that is where I am now. For the first month, I wore it so much because I brought it with me to Japan. For some reason, the month after, even though I wore it just as much as I did in Japan, I didn't make any progress. Then I I was so tired of it, I gave it a break for a week or so, and then I have started to use it again. So the past two weeks, I have made that much progress as I did in the month in Japan, where I was in two weeks. So, I have no idea what's going on, but I'm really, really excited that I could make this much progress in like a week or two. I'm just going to wear the heck out of that red lipstick so I can finish it by the end of the year. I really want to because I have too many red lipsticks that I can justify having it for 2019 and I really don't want, I don't want to throw it out because it is one of my favorite kinds of lipsticks. These lipsticks are so beautiful on the lips and they are so easy to wear because they're so comfortable and you don't really have to think about it. They're not really long lasting but they are really long lasting if you put a lip liner underneath. I really really love these. I really do. This update is all over the place and I am so sorry. <laughs> So for the gold color in Gryffindor, I chose this one. This is the NYX Lingerie Eye Tint. It is a cream shadow and I love this stuff. I did a panning look with it, uh, with my uh, chocolate bar. And I have used it for every single eye look for three months. I can count it on one or two hands how many times I have used another cream shadow that I am nearly finishing. I can see it getting down there, right? But still going and there's a lot of product in these. There are 0.13 fluid ounces and 4 milliliters. Yeah, that's my progress and now you can maybe see why I am ending this a week early. I'm just not going through my products. So. That's everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any videos and projects in the future. I have been enjoying this so much because I'm a huge Harry Potter fan and I actually wanted to wear my Harry Potter t-shirt for this finale, but it is in the wash, so I can't wear it. But I bought this t-shirt of Wish and I love it so much. That is my finale. I hope you guys enjoyed and until next time, please take care. Bye.